Hello friends, in this video you are going to see question number 6 of exercise uh, 9.5 from the chapter differential equation of NCRT maths textbook class 12. Friends, the question is like this, we have been given this differential equation. We have to show that this equation is homogeneous and after that we have to solve it. Okay, so for this we take the differential equation and first thing what we are going to do, we are going to prove that it is homogeneous for that I require the value of dy by dx okay so I'm going to uh, form an expression for dy by dx for this I take y dx on right hand side and taking dx common from both the terms I get x dy is equal to square root of x square plus y square plus y dx okay and you can see that we can write it is very clear that dy by dx is equal to square root of x square plus y square plus y upon x okay so we assume this right hand side as equal to f of x y okay and after that we calculate the value of f of lambda x lambda y and this will be obtained by replacing x with lambda x and y with lambda y and this will be equal to square root of lambda square x square plus lambda square y square plus lambda y upon lambda x okay we can write f of lambda x lambda y is equal to lambda upon lambda times square root of x square plus y square plus y upon x you can see that from the square root we can take lambda square common because there is a square root so we are going to get lambda as common and uh, that is why we can write lambda common from numerator also and denominator it is very clear that we can take lambda as common okay and this can be written as lambda to the power of 0 times f of x y now because we have the value of f of x y and f of lambda x lambda y is equal to lambda to the power of 0 times f of x y so this shows that this function f of x y is a homogeneous function of degree 0 and because dy by dx is equal to a homogeneous function of 0 degree or which has a degree 0 therefore the given equation is homogeneous okay now we are going to solve the differential equation so we have already calculated dy by dx as equal to this much now to solve a homogeneous differential equation we have to do a substitution the substitution is y is equal to vx on differentiating both the sides of this equation with respect to x as always we are going to get dy by dx as equal to v plus x dv upon dx we are going to place the value of dy by dx as equal to v plus x dv upon dx okay and y is equal to vx to obtain v plus x dv upon dx is equal to square root of x square plus x square v square plus vx upon x further I have taken this these two terms contain x square so for our so taking common x square i can write x into x square uh, x into square root of 1 plus v square now from numerator we can take x as common and this can be cancelled with x written in the denominator so i get v plus x dv upon dx is equal to square root of 1 plus v square plus v these two v's and v on the left hand side and right hand side can be cancelled so i get x dv upon dx is equal to square root of 1 plus v square or 1 upon square root of 1 plus v square dv is equal to 1 upon x okay integrating both the sides of the equation we get integration of 1 upon square root of 1 plus v square dv is equal to integration of 1 upon x dx integration of 1 upon square root of 1 plus v square with respect to v is equal to log of v plus square root of 1 plus v square and integration of 1 upon x is equal to log x and log c is the integral constant because both the terms are of are in the terms of log okay further replacing the value of v as equal to y upon x i get log of y upon x plus square root of 1 plus for v square I have written y square upon x square is equal to log of cx I have combined both these terms log m plus log n is equal to log m into n both the terms are uh, both the sides have the terms in form of log so 
log of something is equal to log of something then both the values can be written as equal so i get y upon x plus square root of 1 plus y square upon x square is equal to cx taking lcm i get y upon x plus square root of x square plus y square upon x square is equal to cx taking the square root of numerator and denominator separately i can write this as y upon x plus square root of x square plus y square upon x is equal to cx multiplying both sides of the equation with x so i'm going to get y plus square root of x square plus y square is equal to cx square which is the required solution of the differential equation so in this manner we are going to solve this question friends thanks for watching my video to watch more of these super videos and for the latest updates subscribe and like the videos on these channels on youtube hsk shiksha and math help by hsk thank you